Got a new little part here to install on a Toyota. This is a Toyota part. Now I could have gone with an aftermarket, a cheap, a cheap part here to, to put on the Tundra, but um, I decided to go the Toyota. The Toyota one looked, I would say, the, had the best fit and finish. Uh, you got to be careful. This is an exhaust tip, but you have to be careful with those because you know, depending on how they mount, they will get all wonky on you, and the bolts snap off, and you'll lose it, or somebody can steal it. So let's check this thing out. So here we go. This is part number PT 932-34180-02. It is the Tundra exhaust tip in black chrome. So let's see that, so you can see that. Okay, just open this thing up. See what we got here. It's got a lot of wrapping on it. All right. This is the sleeve that goes apart around the uh, the smaller part of the exhaust pipe. Let's see what we got here. Wow! Look at that. That's a nice looking exhaust tip. Has the Toyota emblem embossed in it it's really nice what looks to be a 14 millimeter bolt well wow, that's pretty cool that looks good and it's solid i mean toyota makes quality trd parts um i like this all right then we have this so what this does and i will show you on the install is it goes around the pipe like the narrow part, and then this slides on and goes over it. So let me get some tools, and we will start getting this installed. All right, this is my Harbor Freight tool kit that I got my, my son for his car. And we're just going to get some tools out of this one. It was easier to get to. Let's see here. I guarantee you this is metric. Uh, let's see. Oh. So I'm thinking it's not a 14 mil. I'm thinking this could be. Yes, this is a 15 millimeter. 15 mil, which is interesting. I would have, I would have thought since a lot of muffler stuff is 14, that and especially on the cars as they come from the factory, I thought this would be a 14, but it's not. So that's okay, not a big deal. This is a pretty decent tool set. This is their, uh, let's see what it is. I guess it's the mechanics. One of the mechanics tool sets it has half inch, three eighths, and quarter. All the sockets you need. It comes with uh, comes with the deep sockets and the shallow. Uh, it comes with these things here. Um, you know, it's got a little crescent wrench, some side cutters, needle nose pliers, and everything you really need. These are Allen wrenches. I don't really like the way those were placed in there, but you know, what are you gonna do? I'm gonna set that there so it doesn't get scratched up. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to wipe this down. Here we go. So these will go on like this. I don't know if you can see that. And you will slide this over like that. Let 
And I will put the 15. I want that Toyota emblem straight up. I've put those two collars in there. I guess they're collars. I don't know what you call them. It did not come with any install directions. So you have to be careful here. You don't want to strip anything. I think I have a little more tightening here. I'm gonna have to get a 15 millimeter deep socket. <clears throat> that is not going anywhere. <clears throat> That's it. And I will show you, it is as tight as I can get it. It looks pretty good. Now somebody said it would change the noise, but I doubt that. I doubt I would be able to hear a difference. This is what I was tightening. As you tighten that, these flat metal pieces kind of curve into the clamp. Right there. I don't know if you can see those, but that's as tight as I'm going to tighten it. It doesn't need to be any tighter. It is really on there. It's not going anywhere. So that's pretty cool. There's the Toyota emblem. So let's start it up. I think it sounds the same, but it looks pretty good. Well, hey guys, I hope you like my little simple install of the Toyota exhaust tip for the 2021 Toyota Tundra. I'm sure this will fit the 2014 through 21s, um, maybe even earlier models, maybe even the new twin turbo V6 if they're still running. Um, it's a very good quality product. Uh, I picked this one up on um on Amazon. You can get them on eBay. You can get them at your Toyota dealer. I will tell you, I paid half as much for this on Amazon as the dealer. I was really kind of disappointed because the dealer's close. I ran up there to get one. They didn't have it on their website. All they had was uh, these tips for uh, Tacomas, new Tacomas. And if you were walked their lot, all the new Tacomas had this tip on it. I guess, you know, and they were charging a uh, $150 for this. I got it for around, uh, I think around $80 on Amazon. I, plus or minus, but right around there. Uh, you know, even if you had to pay a hundred bucks for this, uh, to get the quality, um, that's still a lot cheaper for some reason. I don't, the dealer didn't used to be this far out of in the prices, um, than what you could get online. Uh, maybe they've raised them. Maybe it's just this exhaust tip. Uh, I'm not sure. Anyways, it went on really easy. It's very secure. It's not going to fall off or vibrate off. Uh, I don't really have much to say. It doesn't change the noise. Uh, you know, I've put exhaust on the uh, Subaru. We've put one on the Ridgeline. They sound awesome. My 2.5 liter Subaru, it's non-turbo. Sounds like a turbo fixed up WRX now. Love the sound. Uh, it makes it fun to drive, even though it's way underpowered compared to the V8. If you want this sticker, I'll put a link under the video in the description. Along with everything else, including this, I'll put a couple of links to where you can uh, research this and find it if you want to check it out. There is some aftermarket ones. I'll put a couple of links to those if I can find some decent ones. Uh, I have not installed any aftermarket ones uh, on. Um, 
on this vehicle. Only the Ridgeline got an aftermarket one. Um, but that's all I've got today. Kind of wish it made a little noise somehow. Uh, I guess I'd have to maybe put the TRD Pro exhaust on there or some other exhaust or just a muffler. Um, but for now, I'm happy with it. This V8 makes enough noise for the neighborhood. So uh, anyways, that's all I got for you today. Again, links are under the video in the description. Please subscribe. Please hit the thumbs up. I got merch. If you're interested in any t-shirts or hoodies or anything like that, check that out if you're interested or need anything. And, uh, and I will see you next time. See ya. You always got to have your fishing poles when you travel. This is my go-to bait right here. It's one of these tube worms. And uh, man, I can catch fish everywhere with this thing. And catch bass in the rivers, bass in the ponds, anywhere. Uh, just wanted to share that with you. Let's move on.